bodies were found dead. But away from that, learning at Egerton University could be paralyzed in the next few days if lecturers' grievances are not addressed. Now, lecturers at the university have threatened to down their tools less than a year after they agreed on a return to work formula with the university management of a myriad of issues, including an illegal pay cut. The Dons are accusing the university management of backtracking on the agreements, even without consultations. Among the issues raised is that the Dons were to be paid 120% of salaries for a period of 14 months to cater for an illegal 40% pay cut that had been effected on them last year. They're also decrying an increase in their workload, even without consultations or their pay. The University Academic Staff Union, that is WASU, is now demanding for an explanation and review within seven days, failure to which they will give and strike notice. You recall that we were being paid 60% of our pay back then. We said we will get back to 100%, and the areas which were 40% would be paid in half, 50-50, so that every month you shall get uh, 120%. But uh, honestly speaking, from the onset, that CBA has not been implemented fully. And um, of great concern is that even when we try to understand our situation, the more we try to understand it, the more they try to take more from us. Because like today, we are back to 100%. Yet, no mercy or what was attributed to, the, uh, the, to, to that cause was COVID-19. And that time we were doing online, so they said there were no students around. But now students are, are back. We have taught two full semesters, physic, uh, physical teaching. We are also concerned about reviews and promotions. While our members acknowledge the shortlisting and commencement of interviews, they are clearly concerned about the frequency and secrecy in which and opaqueness with which this exercise is being carried out. In this regard, the union demands clear reviews and promotion schedules for all the cadres of staff.